Here I go. Hey, 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 everybody. Happy Monday. This is Eric coming to you from the office inside of the house. Man, incredible weekend, incredible things happened in a bunch of different companies. Um, a lot of good stuff going on. But, uh, man, I got to tell y'all this story. This, like, really tripped me out. So, you know, typically every Sunday, um, I, I just kind of take a break. You know, I rest. I don't really do any work. You know, I just kind of, you know, it's, you know, I don't know. I, I put my brain on pause, you know what I mean? And I just do, I don't know, I just do fun stuff or relaxing things for me that's relaxing. You know, I, I'm a movie person. I watch movies, uh, you know, went to church. Um, you know, I just, you know, I just take a, I take a break, you know, because some, sometimes you got to give yourself a break, you know. Uh, you know, the earth was created in six days, the seventh day, God rested. So, you know, there there needs to be a day of rest from work. So while um so you know uh you know while we're in church, my son leans over to me and he says, Hey, Dad, when we get home, can we play Mortal Kombat eleven? And I was like, Okay, you know, you know, it's father son time, you know, spend some time with my son, you know, doing some things that he likes to do. So we get home. You know, we eat and he, so I'm eating. Now, I, I ain't thinking, I, I remember I told him that, you know, we was going to do this, but, you know. So he, he hurries up and eats. And then he tells me, hey, I'm going to go, you know, just kind of warm up. All right? Because, you know, I'm, I'm, br I'm bringing the pain when I pick up the controller. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't pull no punches. I don't do none of that. I, get, look here, if you pick up the controller, I don't know you. <laughs> Okay, so he said, let me go warm up while you eating. So I'm like, whatever, you know, all right. So we get in there and we're playing the game, you know. And man, I mean, he is whooping my tail. You hear me? I mean, he he flipping around. He he hitting me with mallets. I mean, just everything. You know what I'm saying? He he throwing energy blasts at me. I mean, this is going on. I mean, we going back and forth. I mean, don't get me wrong. I got I got him a few times, but nowhere near how many times he would. Matter of fact, he whooped me so many times he quit doing uh uh finishing moves. <laughs> he was like, I don't want to do no more finishing moves. I let's just let's just play again, right? So he whooping me that bad, right? And now I'm using the same character because my thing is I'm going to learn the character. When I learn the character, I'm going to be dangerous. But I only learned like four moves. He he choosing all kinds of different characters. He doing all these crazy moves and everything. And I'm just kind of like, OK, you know, he been he been playing, you know, he been playing more than I have. OK, and it's, I, I get it. You know, I'm just I'm just chilling. It's father son time, right? So then he hits the he hits the menu screen and he starts going through the menu. Now I've seen him do this before, and usually he's looking for some different moves or something like that. Hey Darnesia, hey Ron, how y'all doing? Good good morning. So usually I you know he's looking for some moves or something, but he goes to a part of the game that I never seen before. So I'm looking at the screen and he's clicking on stuff and then he makes this comment and he says, oh, I don't have the right attributes loaded. What attributes? So I said, I said, what are you talking about? He says, well, you can, you know, you got, you, you got, you got, you know, attributes. I said, well, I just been playing with what the game loaded in. You know, I just pick my character and I just go, you know. And he said, yeah, but 
you can load different attributes to do different things to that character. When was you going to tell me that? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, hey, Angela. So I'm like, what do you mean? He says, well, dad, look, if you go here, see, you can load different attributes, you know, according to your fighting style or whatever. So your character will, will automatically do some things while you fighting. What? That's, oh, oh, man, you got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. What you mean you can load different attributes so that your character automatically does? So I'm like tripping. So I want to ask you, what attributes are you using? Because, see, we are all born with certain gifts, certain calling, certain things. So what I want to know is, have you loaded the attributes that will automatically work for your success? Have you gone back through this game of life and say, wait a minute, let me change attributes because this one ain't working. So let me load this attribute up and see how that works for me. Because you only get one shot at this thing. And so if you don't like where you are, pause the game, go to your settings, look at your attributes. You have a myriad of them. Look at your attributes and, 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 and say, okay, now, okay, I'm using that one. That one seems to be working okay. Okay, that one's cool. Okay, this one, mm, let me click this one off and uh, let me put, oh, you know what? I ain't used this one in a while. Let me put this one in here. Does that make sense? We, we have so many things that we can use at our disposal and, and we get locked in to using one, two, three, four of them. When, when, when there are so many more, I'm telling you, he was doing all kinds of crazy stuff to me in the game. I'm going to tell you how bad he was whooping. He was playing the game and he was watching videos on his phone at the same time. <laughs> And, and, and then I kind of got upset because I was like, dude, when, you was, when was you going to tell me about all the attributes that you could load in? He was like, I thought you knew. <laughs> so, so when you are going out over the Internet and you're talking to people who are saying, I made, I made $11,000 in 48 hours. I did this and I did that. I did that. And then you go to talk to them. Nine and a half times out of 10, they are going to talk to you as if you already know the secret. That's how they talk to you. They talk to you as if you already know the secret and they're just reminding you. When that's bull, you didn't even know. But watch this. I couldn't be, I couldn't really be mad at him because why? I had access to the same game. Nothing was stopping me from going and reading the rules, seeing up, seeing how the game was played, getting on YouTube, finding some other gamers who played the game and learning from them. Nothing stopped me from doing that. It was my assumption that this was the only way to play the game. And you have to stop assuming that the thing that you have learned in all of your years is the only way to do something. Times have changed. And if you don't change and evolve with it, you are going to be left behind, broke, busted, and disgusted. So when are you going to change your attributes? When are you going to pause? Y'all like how I did that? <laughs> when are you going to pause the game and say, wait a minute, I need to load something different because this ain't working. Whatever it is, if you don't like where you're at, 
your whatever attributes you have loaded, what whatever mindset you've been working under is not working. Stop and change your attributes. And do it quickly because the game is still being played. And it's not waiting on you. The clock is ticking. You taking hits. You being thrown left and right. They throwing stuff at you. You got to pause and change your attributes so that you can put some things in place that will work for you automatically. And here's the thing. If you really do some soul searching, you know what it is. You know what it is, but somebody convinced you to stop doing it. Or something happened and you put it down because you felt like you were there. And the truth of the matter is, is that since life is a journey, you can never stop moving. So even if you have achieved a level of success, a level of accomplishment, things like that, it doesn't mean that now you can take a break. It actually means that there's more for you to do. So what attributes are you using? That's what I want to know. What attributes, or, or, or better yet, what attributes are you not using? See, the Bible says that your gift will make room for you. I always heard that scripture and I kind of understood it. But after, after you know, the thing yesterday with, with my son, I have a new revelation on that. See, but your gift will only make room for you if you load in the attributes so you can play the game on a different level. See, he, <laughs> let me tell you something. It's so crazy. Anytime a person can switch to seven different characters and whoop you the same way, you, you, you might want to pause the game and <laughs> load some attributes up. But guess what? Because I am who I am, now that I know, I'm going to use that to my advantage. And I'm going to go whoop his tail some more today. See, he don't know that unless he's listening to me right now on the slot. See, but once you show me how to do something, how to get to where you are, once you show me a pathway and that's where I want to go, guess what Eric does? Eric follows that daggum pathway. Why? Because if I knew, I would have done it already. If you don't know, find that person who does know. Follow their path. Why? Because they've already paved it for you. You know, a lot of times we, you know, we feel like we have to forge the path. And, and we have to, you know, well, well, you know, we just have to do it this way because, you know, we tread new ground. 9.9 .9 times out of 10, you ain't treading new ground. You just haven't met the person who already paved the way for you. And so what I'm telling you is, if, if you are not using your attributes, you're trying to forge ground that's already been paved. That's asinine. That's asinine. Why would you do that? You, you're jumping from this networking company to this networking company to this networking company to this networking company, and, and, and you're spinning your wheels and you're spending money and you're frustrating yourself because why? You haven't loaded in the right attributes because the right attributes will find that thing that jizes with you. That's a new word, gizes, G-I-Z-E-S, gizes. It means, it means it energizes with you. And when you find that thing that gizes with you, those attributes that you load will automatically kick in and then things will move. 
you still going to have some challenges. Just because I load in these attributes today don't mean he ain't going to be still trying to hit me. Don't mean he ain't going to hit me. Don't mean he ain't going to win some battles. But I bet I'm going to win way more than I did yesterday. And that's the mindset we have to have. Every day win a little bit more. Every day win just a little bit more. It doesn't matter if it's a step. Every day, our goal should be to win a little bit more. And then a little bit more. And then a little bit more. And then when we look back and we're like, oh my gosh. Okay, well now I need to win a lot more. And a lot more. And a lot more. And now, oh, well look. You, 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 you need some help? Come on. You should get to a place where you give as much or more than you receive. But realistically, you got to take care of self first. That's why when you're flying, the pre-flight check, they tell you, any adults traveling with children, in case of an emergency and the oxygen mask drop down, put your mask on first. Why? Because if you put your mask on first, then you can help the child. So fix your attributes. Hey, Kosom, how you doing? Good morning. Fix your attributes so that you can help others. Think of, think about it. next time you fly, man. We, man, we, man, we, we done flew up some miles. So next time you fly, just, just pay attention to what they're saying. In the event of an emergency, we're gonna drop the oxygen masks. Parents, put your mask on first. Pull the cord and oxygen will start flowing freely. Then put the mask on your child. You got to help you first. Pause the game. Load up the attributes that you have not been using. And then jump back in. And win a little more. But you, you got to. I mean, you 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 have to look and you have to diagnose what has not been working. What has not been working? And you got to stop it. You got to stop it. If it ain't working, stop it. Kill it. <laughs> you got to stop it. If it's not working, stop it. Load in some more attributes. And go back to playing the game. I'm telling you, it was powerful. It was powerful. I don't know. We played for probably, I don't know. We played for probably a good hour, hour or two, you know. And we, it was a good hour and a half of playing before he showed me that in the game that you could load in different attributes. <laughs> so, you know, you got to understand. Some people because of who you are, think you should already know. So they won't tell you. They won't tell you. And it's not their fault. It's because they have such a high regard for you. Most times. Sometimes they could be haters. Okay. But I feel like, you know, when you go to people and especially if you're paying somebody and they say, I have this, this attribute that's going to help you get to where you want to be. And then you pay them this money. And then they talk to you as if you already know about this. But I wouldn't have paid you. So you need to be careful when you're playing this game of life and you're playing this game of business and online marketing and affiliate marketing and all that, you have to be careful who 
you are getting information from. Be careful of the sender. Hey, Rico, what's up, King? How you doing? You got to be careful of who you are receiving information from. What's their intent? Is their intent just to make money? Or is their intent truly to help you? Because why? If, if you don't have the attribute, you got to learn the attribute. And in order to learn the attribute, you have to trust the person you are getting that information from. Why? Because when you put that attribute in and it starts going haywire, you kind of got to blame yourself. So you have to be careful who you are receiving information from. Watch the people who you share your successes with. I remember, I remember this one time that uh, uh, me and my wife, we were in Prime America. And, you know, we were doing very well. We were doing very well. God really blessed us. We we're doing really well. And our team was doing well. We were training our team, you know. Uh, so <laughs> what happens is every month in the office, they do a round of awards, you know, uh, 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 what was it? Most recruits, um, uh, most um, sales, you know, uh, just, you know, a myriad of awards. Right. So m me and my wife and our team kept being called up. I mean, we couldn't sit back down before our name was being called again for another award. So I'm like, yeah, you know, I'm, <laughs> you know, I'm done high fiving people. And we get back to my seat. My wife tells me, she says, hey. And I'm like, what? You know, what's the hell? We, we, we killing it, you know. She said, hey, everybody don't celebrate with you. What? Look, she said, no, no, no. Listen to me. Everybody ain't always happy about your success. And when I looked around through those eyes, I saw what she meant. Man, them folks was hating. They was hating on us. They really were. I mean, for real hating on us. Because it wasn't just us. It was our entire team that was taking every single award. Every one of them. And man, them people was, oh yeah, they was clapping. But ooh, and they back, ooh, they was hating. Oh my God. God, they was hating. And the reason why is because they couldn't figure out how we were doing it. But we had loaded some attributes that, that made that stuff happen for us. And we worked it. We worked it. And we taught our team to work it. And then we gave our team those attributes. So they could be successful and they could get the awards and they could get the checks. Because that's what we do. So if you are not happy where you're at, it doesn't even have to be money. It could be in relationships. It could be in money. It, 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 it could be in anything. If you're not where you're at, if you're not where you want to be right now, pause the game. Look at your attributes. See which ones are working. Leave those alone. The ones that don't seem to work, it, click them off and replace it with something else. Click it off and replace it with something else. It's your attributes, baby. It was so simple when, when my son told me that. I mean, he just said it real nonchalantly. What, what, you know, Dad, you know you got attributes that you could turn on and off in the game. You know I didn't know that. <laughs> Cheating turkey. <laughs> so I'm telling y'all, it's attributes that you can load in the game. So you can't, now you can't say you didn't know. I'm telling you, it's attributes you can load in the game that will help you win. Go get them. 
This is Eric. Thank you so much, everybody who came on. I know it's early. Please, please, please share this video. Uh, join my group here. Um, I'm doing a lot more training in the group, just exclusively for people who are in there. A lot of hands-on tutorial stuff. I'm also creating my YouTube page, so be on the lookout for that. I'll make that announcement soon when it's up and purdy looking and all this stuff. But please share this video. It's super important because people need to hear that there is something they can do to get out that rut. All right? And I want to take this moment to thank the Most High God for blessing me with unexpected and immediate financial abundance. And I pray the same for each and every one of you listening. Hey, Dwayne, hey, catch the replay, man. I'm wrapping up, but I'm glad you hopped on. Um, so go forward, prosper. And I'll see you guys in the next video.